Ain't about your bread and I can't fuck with y'all I thought you was a honey, but you showed me 50 And the crew that's parked outside, that bitch looks so expensive Self-entitled woman Get humble, don't care, let's have into this This new free speech ranking survey by Spite so that 94% of UK universities have censored free speech in the past year. Some have no platform, people like Germaine Greer, Roger Scruton, and a human rights activist called Miriam Namazi. Are you happy with that? I don't believe it's censorship. I believe that freedom of speech is also freedom to accept the consequences of that speech. And if that means that certain institutions don't want uh, to promote or give you a platform to say these things, then you have to accept that. Really? Yes, I do. That's, that's not uh, curtailing freedom of speech? No, I don't think it is. Um, well, pe thought, pe but, but, people, but, but, people like Domingo... Are, are you just taking people. away the freedom of these people to speak at the university? They can speak wherever they like, but, but it's, freedom of speech is not freedom to be invited wherever you want. Um, what's the point being, of a university if you don't allow a variety of views to be expressed. A variety of views, that's absolutely fine. Clearly um, not, if you're Jermaine Greer. I think if... Gotcha, bitch! Students are being asked to pay increasingly higher fees, and I think that if they object to um, people like Jermaine Greer, Julie Bindle, Milo Yiannopoulos, uh, being given frequently pretty hefty speaking fees themselves and be given a platform at their university. Julie then I Bindle think they have doesn't a right... take fees for that. Julie Bindle does okay. not take fees. And she has worked for 30 mm. years raising awareness of violence against women and done so thanklessly. And for her to be barred from universities simply because she has a different view to you or some of the people in that university about transgender issues is a disgrace, as it is with Peter Tatchell. She's basically saying they can speak wherever they want, they just can't speak in a university or near me. And if it offends me, then there's consequences. Everything so she said speech, when I'm out here. And the worst Everything part about it is you're doing when, I'm like, I wasn't when you're meant to be able to express your opinion to say what the f you want. So I came across this on Twitter, right? It says women have way more gained than men. Well, that's a lie. Women are terrible at shooting their shot. Right. You know how many women have had their friends come and say something to me for them? Y'all are petrified to even introduce yourself. Or you'll do this thing to where you'll look at a guy that you're interested in for like a second, two times, and then be like, I hope he reads my mind like he's Professor X and, and knows right. that I'm interested. If not, then I guess we're not meant to be. It's like, well, that's exactly why your ass is sleeping alone and you're upset about it. Example, I work with some girls at a job I have. The other day, a guy came in, pretty good looking dude. Some girl came up and was like, damn, that guy's fine. She didn't want to say nothing. Second girl comes up talking about the same guy and she's like, damn, I want to sit on his face. I'm like, well, go say something. They didn't want to say nothing. He leaves. She comes up. Did he leave? I'm like, yeah, he left. She's like, did you tell him what I said? Why the f would I tell him what you said? Y'all won't even introduce yourself. And when we're interested in a girl, we have to actually go and say something. Y'all won't even do that. Y'all do not have more game than men. Just stop it. Because a lot of them are terrified. I was working one time and they this can't take uh, you. I tell you what, the like, women are going to have to start approaching men more because it's becoming more or less impossible for us to do so without time. getting in trouble. Hey, no, 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 no. Get to the point. No. Stop. Stop. You can do like. Took offense to what I said. I apologize. My my comment was wasn't made to, even towards black people. I was talking about myself. Period. I wasn't comparing myself to. And how they explain? That's it. Okay, that's it. Yeah. That's if, it. If, if, so if that's anyone, your problem. That's anyone, it. If anyone took it the wrong way, I'm sorry. That's that's their fault. I didn't. No. No. That's it. Mean? I'm no. sorry. What do you mean? That's not no. their fault. That's just say that sorry. Fault. No, just it's say, fault. bro. That's no, it. That's just say. Hey, Coyle Ray. No, that's, that's it. That's it. Bad baddie need Coyle Ray in her that's life, it. bro. Bro, I, I showed you some roast earlier, but you're going to be a roast. You're going to do that. Don't play. Don't play. Coyle Ray, yeah. Don't play. I'm not laughing. But I don't give a about these people. Look like I did it all no, it day. don't look like no, it don't. Stop thinking. And if you know you made a mistake, just be a woman about it, bro, and just let the fucking know that it's not going to happen again. It's dead. That's it. Now she gonna fucking get me mad. You heard what the fuck she said. I'm out of here. So this is that bad Barbie nice. girl that catch me outside, girl. Just that meme you of a girl. You gotta stop feeling like you gotta explain yourself. Like she a real ass friend. People, That's how I am, bro. I'm like Coyle Ray. Instead of saying race, sorry, she tried to justify her actions. Luckily, she met her match with Coyle Ray. Say, She's a rapper. Please. And she just shut her up. This is true, I've got no sympathy. There's four billion men in the world and you're chasing one that's going after another girl that doesn't give a fuck about you.
That one there was a violation person. So this young lady posted this, I think, on Twitter. I feel sorry for men. These new batch of bitches, God let Satan release them. They don't pray, cook, clean, raise kids, and barely pay bills. They don't even want to act like women. They want to get money and BBLs and sit on their modified asses while men take care of them. So this girl in the comments said, if I'm doing all the domestic labor, I'm not paying any bills, right? So I said, women like you need to understand that cooking and cleaning and taking care of your kids is not a traditional role. It is now a life skill that every person, man or woman, should know how to f***ing do. We're grown. You should never listen to any of the hate or any of that these just throw you on the internet because they don't know what the f*** they're talking about they don't get no real money they don't know nothing about that cooking and cleaning is the bare minimum for any normal human being having a kid is a choice i am you don't providing get your you don't life get prizes for doing all that shit. women that speak like that and say that type of shit without me you would be they don't be traditional women and they say they don't want average men but most men are average technically if you're gonna look into financial terms and these women that have these demands a lot of them are average they don't bring anything to the table just like this woman so Explain to us why a average man does not deserve a submissive woman. Um, because <laughs> if most of these is average mm -hmm. and all of them act the same, mm -hmm. <laughs> what are we chatting about? You stupid. <laughs> all right, so we don't know what the that just meant. Can no, we, I know what it means. No, can we get some further elaboration? Because we don't know what the that means. I would like to know. Everything ain't shit. Oh, shit. What you mean they ain't shit? Because they don't have a lot of money? No, it's not even about the money. Them as themselves ain't shit. What? So, then they don't come with the coin on top of that. Okay, so, but 90% of men are average. So you're saying 90% of men ain't shit? Men are broke. Okay, so, they, so you're saying they broke? So because they broke, they ain't shit? Is that what you're saying? No, it's not that they broke, they knocked it. They knocked it already on top of being broke. Oh, okay. But what, but what makes them not sh** <laughs> Their ways. Cheaters, liars, manipulators. Mm, I'm so glad you said that. What do you think high-value men do? Same. Not really. Oh, so you think high-value men are faithful? I think they care more. Oh. What? what? You stupid. Oh, wow. okay. Because they, they got they money? Yeah. High-value men don't give a fuck. Yes, they, they're high-value. They got money. So you no. saying just because they got more money that they more faithful? No. No. That's what you're saying. So what, you think they are more faithful? I think they are. You think they care more? Nah. She dumb as fuck. I ain't gonna lie. Hey, Leia, I got blessing on you. I'm finna see y'all next video, bro. I'm a cool, but not a good. I got your picture, I am packing down. Ain't about your blood, and I'm